checking the prices now I wanted to go out and buy some new clothes because I needed some for like the fall autumn wintery time because I only really have summery clothes and I really wanted to turn this into a challenge somehow so I saw this video and it looked so much fun like this challenge so the first shop that I went to was Urban Outfitters and I just want to say I've never actually been to Urban Outfitters before so I have no idea what sort of prices it's gonna be but I can kind of guess but it was actually really difficult to like go into a place and like try to not look at the prices like it's actually kind of a challenge in this video I do go to a lot of like shops that I haven't been to before but I also do go to my normal shops that I be to that I go to quite a bit this should be an interesting challenge like I even went to some more expensive stores than normal so let's see right so as you can see I did get quite a few things from here so how it worked was basically I went into the store I tried to find items that I liked, I tried to try them on and look at the size, you know, find my size without looking at the price, so quite often I just covered the tag with my hand and then I also got my mum to pay at the counter so that way I don't ever see the price. Anyways. The first item that I got was this top here and I feel like this is just so cute and it's sparkly and it's just gorgeous. Anyways, so I'm probably going to guess that this was six pounds. I feel like that, I reckon about six pounds because I don't really know what sort of price Urban Outfitter, Outfitters is but I reckon about six pounds. 145 deer hams. Oh, okay. <laughs> Did I say six pounds? Yeah, I think I said six pounds. It's actually 30 pounds. Moving on! The next item that I got is this green tartan dress, which I feel like is so cute and it's kind of like wintry and it just looks really nice. So I'm probably, I'm gonna go higher, definitely quite a bit higher than the last one. So if the top was 30 pounds, by the way guys, in Dubai basically everything is way more expensive to like ship to the middle of the desert, I guess. So I'm always probably gonna guess like low. Anyways, right, 40 pounds, I'm gonna say 40 pounds, right? Oh. Um, let me just put this in the translator. Translator? Converter. Okay, so this one I was a bit closer. I said 40 pounds, it was actually 45 pounds. So it's still more expensive, but kind of closer to what I was expecting. But I feel like if I hadn't have seen the last price, I probably would have said about 25 pounds. So, yeah. <laughs> okay, so the next item that I got was this lilac top. Now, I reckon this is going to be about 15, 15 pounds, okay? I'm gonna say 15. Okay, so it's actually 27 pounds, and I think I said 15. <laughs> I'm so bad at guessing the prices of stuff. I don't know, I feel like everything is cheaper than it actually is. Um, okay, wow, so this is actually 27 pounds. Okay, so I know that I'm definitely gonna be shocked by this price now. So, the next item that I bought was this coat because I needed a coat or like a jacket and it's really soft and fluffy and cute and it is also kind of waterproof because like the inside of it is and it's got a hood because my only jacket at the moment doesn't have a hood so I'm going to say this is about 80 pounds I'm going to go for 80 pounds I feel like I've actually I, I'm not going to say anything but I feel like it's actually cheaper I don't know yes this is actually 57 pounds I did feel like 80 pounds was a lot I was just saying like way higher than I thought it would be because all the other ones were way higher. But that makes more sense. About 60 pounds makes more sense. So yeah, that one's not too bad actually. So the next item I got from Urban Outfitters is this black top, which is kind of like, it's a crop top, but it's like got this little bit at the bottom which you can like tighten it. I feel like it looks really cute. And I just feel like this will go with a lot of nice stuff. Anyways, so how much is it? I'm gonna say this is, because it has got this bit on it, which I feel like makes it more expensive. I don't know, it's not just like a basic plain t-shirt. So I'm gonna say this is 25, 25 pounds. Let's see. So this item is actually 33 pounds. Okay, so far I have guessed everything is higher except for one item, so moving on. I have this really 
cute silver bag and I just feel like I don't know how to describe this type of fabric but it's just so cute and I just I just love this bag it looks so nice and I feel like it will go with like pretty much all of my outfits anyways so miracles I'm probably gonna say this is about 30 pounds no 25 25 pounds again right so it's actually, oh, 129 dirhams. Yes, it is actually 27 pounds. I guessed kind of correctly, so almost there. I feel like this is the closest I've got so far, so I'm proud of myself for that one, because so far it's been going terribly. <laughs> okay, so the second shop is going to be Topshop, so let's go and try and find something. Um, let's really, really, really try hard to not look at the prices, because if I see the price of something, then I'm gonna have to put it back, which will just be so sad, so. Let's try. I didn't actually get any um, clothes. I just got accessories. So first up, I'm being really careful not to see the price. I've got these really cute star earrings. I feel like these are so gorgeous. I can't wait to wear them. And I feel like they're kind of festive, but not like overly festive. <sighs> eight pounds. I'm gonna go for eight pounds. They are actually, okay. <laughs> they're definitely not eight pounds. These are actually, in fact, 20 pounds. <laughs> definitely wrong, <laughs> definitely far off. Wow. The next item that I bought are these really cute little pearl clip clips. Yeah, these really cute pearl clips that are white and pink. So I'm gonna say these are 15 pounds, 15, right. 75 dirhams, okay, I feel like I'm actually kind of getting this one. Right, 75 dirhams and pounds. 15 pounds! Finally, well it's 15 pounds 90p, so I think that counts. 15 pounds, finally I got something correct. <laughs> okay, the last item. I got, oh, upside down. These are so gorgeous. I honestly love them so much. They're so cute and they're like little snakes and they're green, so I feel like they kind of go with festive season, but they're a bit, I don't know, they're really cool. So I'm gonna say these are 12, 12 pounds. I'm wrong. It's 75 dear hands as well, which is the same 15 pounds 90p from earlier, so. I mean, that's pretty close. I'm not too far, but, but it just doesn't make sense because you get four clips, you get two clips with this one. But I suppose this one's chance. I don't know, right, anyways. Shop number three, I'm gonna be going to River Island. So let's go. Hopefully, because some of the shops I've been in, there's like the price I've like, written up everywhere so you have to like really be careful not to see it right so i do go to the shop quite often and i feel like i probably know the prices so let's see now i actually ended up only getting one item from here it's this really cute christmasy style tartan top and i feel like it's so cute it was from the kids section which will make it a bit cheaper as well so I'm gonna say this was about 15 pounds. I don't know. Everything is more expensive in Dubai, so I'm just gonna guess it's 15 pounds. Let's see. Oh, I'm wrong. It's 99 dirhams, which is about 20 pounds. Yes, this is actually 21 pounds. So I'm wrong again, but not too wrong, so. So then the next shop I went to was Misguided, and Misguided is more of a cheap shop, so hopefully it's gonna be cheaper, I don't know. But at the same time, I don't shop here too often, so because the clothes don't really fit me that often, but I got this really cute pink denim skirt with like the stitching showing. I love this like contrasting stitching. Anyways, 12 pounds. I'm gonna say it's 12 pounds. So I am wrong. I couldn't find the price on the skirt for some reason, but it is. 27 pounds. I'm I'm very far, very, very far, so that's sad. <laughs> this video is like really, really sad. Okay. So then I went to H&M. Of course, I shop here quite often. I feel like I should know the price of this. Really hope I do. So I got this really cute green, super cozy sweater. And I just feel like this is so gorgeous and cozy. I can't wait to wear it. And I'm gonna say this was 20 pounds. I'm just gonna, I, I, my initial instinct is about like 12 pounds, but I'm just gonna say it's 20 pounds because everything else has been really expensive, okay? I'm wrong. It's 139 dirhams. So it's actually 29 pounds. Okay, so it's not been the worst 
one yet, but it's definitely like far off, so yeah. <laughs> And then the next thing I got is also this really cute like red velvet scrunchie with little pearls on it. So I'm gonna say this is about eight pounds. Eight pounds, I feel like eight pounds is a good price for this. Ooh, I might be right on this one. It might be less actually. It's actually only four pounds, 40 pence. So it's actually less than eight pounds, it's half. Half the price, or a bit over half. So I'm pretty impressed with myself with that one. Well, not impressed, because I didn't get it right. I'm just happy that I like highballed it, <laughs> instead of just lowballing everything. <laughs> now the last shop I went to is a shop I've never been to before, and it's called American Rag. And I have no idea what sort of prices these are gonna be, but I have a feeling they're gonna be expensive. So the first, I'm trying to hide the label so I don't see it. <laughs> So the first item I got was this really cute Fila crop top, and guess what guys? It is furry, it's so cute. Anyways, I'm gonna say this was 25 pounds. Let's see how much it actually was. Oh, 275 dear hands, 58 pounds. What? Um, <laughs> let's just pretend that didn't happen. So the next item I got from this shop was a brand I've never heard of before. It's called like Sick Silk. I'm gonna say this was 40 pounds. It's just like a plain red top, so it's not furry like the last one, but it is a different brand, and I've never even heard of this one, so I have no idea. Oh, oh, okay. I've highballed it. I'm pretty sure I've highballed it. This one was actually 26 pounds. Now I feel like that's more reasonable. 50 pounds for a top. Now the last item I got from this shop is by Tiger Mist, another brand I've never heard of before, but it's just like this little red crop top and I feel like it's so cute and because it's red I tried to get like Christmassy stuff, so anyways, I'm probably going to say this was about 25 pounds, 25 pounds, it was 195 dear hams, it was actually 40 pounds. I am so bad at this. I am so bad at this. So the last shop I went to, considering the rest of the challenge, I'm really scared now. To make this video really fun, I wanted to get some designers. So I wanted to go to a secondhand designer store. So I went to one a few days ago, but you have to like order it online. So meal clubs, I'm now about to go to the shop and I'm a little bit nervous. I'm not really sure what I'm gonna be able to find in here. So let's have a look. And I've also got to be really careful to not see the price, so. This might be difficult. So I got my mum to order this like bracelet for me online and it's arrived, let me show you it. Now I have no idea what the retail price of this is and I also have no idea like what the second hand price of it is. So we're gonna be guessing both. Right, I have all the shipping information, all shipping information, all of the price is in there. So this, is it? It comes with the original box and like some of the original bows as well. The box has got like a lot of makeup and stuff on it, which I was kind of disappointed. I wasn't expecting it to have that, but anyways, it's just the box. I haven't opened it yet, so this is gonna be a first experience for both of us. Oh wow. Wow, it's it's a lot smaller than I expected, but it comes in its original little dust bag, which is in good quality. Oh wow, this is so much smaller. I wasn't expecting it to be this small. Okay, this is the bracelet. It's just a little Dior bracelet and it's got two bits, two bracelet bits. I wanna try it on. I feel like it needs cleaning and then it will be good. Like all the gems and stuff are still there, but it just looks a bit more used than I was expecting. So I'm gonna guess that I the retail price of this because it's quite a small bracelet. I wasn't expecting it to be this small. 100 pounds retail price, you know, brand new. And I'm gonna guess that I bought this for maybe 30 pounds. I don't know. So let's see. I am nervous. So it says that this second hand is $111. So now we're gonna work out how much it was retail price. So I just looked online and I discovered that the retail price the estimated retail price was about $300. For the tiny bracelet, if it was brand new, it'd be $300. That's that's a lot more than 100, that's three times. And um, I actually got it for 100 second hand. So um, yeah, I might be returning that one because um, that's a lot. <laughs> Anyways guys, if you're around here, make sure to click subscribe. Also check out this video here and that video there. I'll see you guys in the next one, bye.